Well, the Niagara Falls School District is keeping students and staff safe and getting them to class on time with a new weapons detection system. They're installed in the high school and middle schools and could move into more buildings. News 4's Kayla Green went to Niagara Falls High School to see how they work. The new weapons detection system at Niagara Falls High School is keeping students safe while getting them to class quicker and more efficiently. It's far less intrusive than having to go through everyone's bag, far more thorough, and it allows our entry into the building in a much uh, more uh, expedited way. We were spending a good 30 minutes checking the 2,000 people that came through the school. Superintendent Mark Laurie says now they can process the entire school in 10 to 12 minutes and get everyone to first period on time. As kids walk through, they can keep moving if the light stays green. If something is detected, those lights turn red and the security officer checks the item that was flagged. We have staff on that will check if it detects some type of threat, but we'd rather be safe than sorry. So if it's anything that, that may be a threat to the school, then you know it's something we want to check out. The school board allocated $641,000 to the system. There are three stations in the high school and two in each middle school. High school principal Cynthia Jones says with so many social media threats made across local districts in the fall, this put everyone more at ease. It has made the climate in the building a little bit more um, comfortable. Um, people are a little bit more at ease um, and it just helps us to recover from the beginning of the school year and to just start to have fun in the building. I just feel like with all the like threats and whatnot that's going on in school systems, um, I feel like everybody's safety is important. So I feel like it's reasonable. In Niagara Falls, Kayla Green, News 4.